Sebastian Munoz, his second shot at the fourth. Seven under par for his competition so far. Ooh. Oh, hello. Nice. And that's how we got there. Paul Casey has got the crushers back to within six, thanks to this a few moments ago. On six for Paul Casey. That will mean points. Not many, but it will mean points. Tyrrell Hatton for birdie at three. Uh, a quick one. Down the slope, into the swale. Oh, oh yes! <laughs> Caleb Surratt for Legion 13. Just down the road in Knoxville. That was a second at 10, and that should be par 5 seventh. It's getting a bit blustery out there. Yeah, forecast for gusts uh, and winds up to 20 miles per hour as the day progresses. Oh, that's an excellent shot. A chance for Eagle there. Now, if Lee Westwood were to roll that in, Waco Neiman with his second shot of 14. He's four under par for his opening six holes today, the Torquay captain. And there is another chance. Simple pitch here. Holable. Well, that's more like it. And that will go into the bonus category for John Rahm, Matthew Wolf. to try and keep this under the wind. Bryson's ball was really affected. Well, that's certainly got more distance than Bryson's. It looks really good. It is. Boy, is it. I think this is a five iron. Just as, boy, does this look good. If it's the right yeah. distance. Oh, man. Well, that's a fantastic shot. That is cracking me up. Torque attempting to get to within three shots of Legion 13. Waco Neiman, the captain. He's playing beautifully today. The majestic Sam Horsfield, his second shot at 14. Yeah, we've seen a lot of shots in close at 14. This green is a little softer. It was softer yesterday, too. And his team lead by five. HV3 at 15. There you go. Mito Pereira, that's the par 5 11th with his third shot. That'll sneak down close. Very close. Over at the nine on tape, this was Anthony Kim. Kepka checking in on him for the first time today. This was a third shot out at the par five, number seven. Gets him to even par on the round, one under total. Fourth place are the crushes. Here's Alaban Lahiri. They're only two back of the Majestics. Oh, it all changes so quickly. Uh, yeah, this is looks just like a full sand wedge. Or a half a sand wedge. I have some spin on it. There it is. Oh, this has a chance. What a shot. Just timed it perfectly. Honor Bond on the tee out at number three. Late 
slight surge perhaps by the crushers to 30 under par and as if by magic legion 13 now lead by eight john catlin rolls in a birdie putt but oh, a big shot here for lee westwood yeah. into the last green these are the opportunities with ian polter in trouble at the third Horsfield and Westwood oh, both playing oh, 18 to par 5. Fantastic shot. Anaban Lahiri has made an eagle at 4. They are 32 under par. They're too clear of third place Torque. Anthony Kim at the 12th for birdie. Oh, well done, mate. So Lee Westwood gave himself an opportunity and the Majestics an opportunity for Eagle at 18. How big could this be? And it drops. A clenched fist for Lee Westwood. It's his best performance easily of the season so far. He's 11 under. Caleb Surratt. Second shot of the sixth. Confirmation that Legion 13 back to 38 under. I don't think it's going to do them too much harm because Sebastian Munoz did this. No way. At three. From off the green, and he seals the crowning moment for Tyrrell Hatton. Tyrrell has tamed the Grove in Tennessee. He has put together three world class <laughs> rounds of golf. 65, 64, 65, 19 under par. He's a live golf champion for the first time.